Five foot four inches tall, Rob Burrow was never the biggest rugby league player, but his speed, skill and courage made him one of the greatest. For a man blessed with such immense sporting talent, it was a cruel diagnosis. Motor neurone disease wasted his muscles and stiffened his body. But as the illness took its toll, Burrow's spirit seemed only to grow stronger. The last years of his life were spent relentlessly raising money for research and helping others who were living with the disease. In a world full of adversity, the Prince of Wales said tonight, Rob Burrow taught us that we must dare to dream. Ellie Pitt has this report. <laughs> To rugby league fans, Rob Burrow will be remembered as one of the sport's most successful players. For others, their memories will be shaped by the disease that defined the last four and a half years of his life. Tonight, the club where he spent his entire career announced that he has died of motor neurone disease at the age of 41. In a statement, Leeds Rhinos have paid tribute to their teammate. Rob never accepted that he couldn't do something. He just found his way of doing it better than anyone else. He will continue to inspire us all every day. I want to remember the good side of Rob. You know, um, it's obviously sad at times like this, but I, I want to remember that the Robert I, I used to see uh, standing naked, you know, holding court in the dressing room with a great sense of humour. And I want to remember the, the courageous guy I played alongside shoulder to shoulder for my country. During his career, Rob was known as the smallest player in the Super League. But he played his stature to his strength and lifted numerous trophies in the 17 seasons he spent at Leeds Rhinos. Two years after he retired came the diagnosis of an incurable disease. You have your good days, your bad days, but, um, yeah... But far from Hyde, Rob shared with the country how the debilitating condition affected him and his family. And through numerous challenges, he raised millions for research. He was so stoical. His sense of humour shone through in how he dealt with this diagnosis and this journey with MND. I mean, it's phenomenal how he coped and what he shared of himself with the community. And we are so grateful for that. For raising money and awareness of the illness, Rob was awarded a CBE. Tonight, Prince William has spoken of Rob's huge heart. And this evening, the outpouring of love for Rob has already begun at the ground he gave his working life to. Got it. Yeah, I feel so very sorry for his family too. Yeah, Three it's little just children. horrible. It's really sad because he's only 41 and he's died, so... And it's quite sad. And he's a legend, to be fair. He'll never be replaced, but he'll always be remembered. Rob Burrow was a legend of the league, but how he made sure his diagnosis would improve the lives of others with MND will be his legacy. Remembering Rob Burrow, who has died at the age of 41.